am everywhere. I am everywhere. Um, uh, in the last five weeks, I've been in uh, six countries and uh, 15 states and only flown three times. So there you go. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, so that's it, a lot that, of Was that the issue? Is like no, no, too it, much was, travel? it was exhaustion, but it was also a sinus infection because you go from the Bahamas to Denver at So it wasn't that you were just so baked to the gills that you couldn't No, depart. no, 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 no. I was messed up, but it wasn't from weed, okay? I had I had taken, I got up at like, uh, like 8 o'clock and did yoga with, I do that DDP yoga, okay, to stretch and make, not, I don't feel bad, okay? And I, I, did, I did my yoga, all right, and I popped a cheek. Chibachu, which is just a small, it's the greatest edible, but it's the most consistent. It's like a Tootsie Roll. It's like a Tootsie Roll, but a small, like like one of those, like those bunk Tootsie Rolls that you get at Halloween, you yeah. know, or in a pinata bag, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. little bunk ones, okay? A little small one, all right? I took that, I, and I'm not baked, but I am certainly relaxed after my workout. I take a shower and go to sleep, but I have a huge sinus and a headache, okay? And it's an infection, all right? And where green stuff is literally coming out of my nose, okay? Cough, do the whole thing, all right? I am a Mucinex commercial, okay? If, if I just called my buddy T.J. Miller to play the voice of my snot, okay, <laughs> it would be awesome. And so um, I... Uh, I, I I am in I'm in focus okay and I am I am nervous because every time I move my head green stuff is coming out okay and oh. I can't stop it okay I just I can't right. and and I I do the neti pot and then like and like a horror show comes out okay and then it's still back and so I go cold medicine as you can tell I might have a touch of a problem with knowing when to say when about <laughs> excess oh my God. okay so I did day quill uh pills, uh, Theraflu Day, uh, Zyrtec, uh, Claritin, and Allegra, okay, and that got a real shake going, okay, I was clear, okay, but I had a shake going, so it's just like they, like, like, you know, I, I've taught guys to, even I've never done cocaine, like if you do coke, you know, they, they will always want to drink to calm down a little bit, so I figure, hey, I got some NyQuil back there, oh, let me chug that God. quill, let me put the quill on top of it, uh, and uh, that red, not that Gucci green, okay, ain't menthol, ain't Newport flair. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, and, and, so, and then you went on stage. And then no, it, it, it was. Uh, and I, I play I like. Okay, this is a very embarrassing thing. Okay, and, and I hate to, but it's the truth. Uh, did you know that the uh, cap, the top cap of uh, Nyquil in the packaging, is a measuring cup? That's the thirty milliliters. Yeah. I did not know that, <laughs> Ralphie. I did not know that. I always just go, "That's about enough," yeah. you know. All right, and so I play, yeah, yeah, just play Nyquil roulette. You Three know? good swallowers. Oh okay. my god! Yeah, yeah. and so Ralphie. hey, you play Nyquil roulette. Every guy in here has played yeah, it. We, okay, we all do it. Okay, it's all thing. We don't keep the cap because you don't see that cap. I've never opened the dishwasher and saw that cap there. Okay. I'm not using that cap. That cap was in the store. I don't care how much plastic you put around it, okay? You dunk it in poop water, it's going to be in that cap. All right? You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I am I am here, Jack. I am in the moment. All right? I take that quill, and I played I quill roulette, and I lost, man. You know, you sometimes lost. you sleep for four hours, six hours. Sometimes you sleep for two days. Well, that's about the amount I took. So how did the story get out? They but, just assume because you obviously are honest and open yeah, about I'm smoking weed. Yeah, I'm honest and open about st- smoking reefer, okay? And... Um, now, and when you're here's the thing though, is that I was competent to to perform. Okay, I was I was of 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 competency. I just check with every live venue in Colorado because of the altitude. They have two M- EMTs as part of their house insurance there with a whole kit and oxygen in case you need O2 for the altitude. Okay, so before you go on, they take your blood pressure, which mine was 122 over 64. Perfect, we, yeah, amazing. Mm, okay, yeah. especially for somebody as fat as I am and at that altitude, that's pretty incredible. And the way I was feeling and the fact that I was jacked up, it's pretty awesome. Okay, so I don't have any problems with blood pressure. All right, and they put an oxygen uh, monitor on my finger. I was 98 on the exhale and 99 on the inhale. They're like, you're fine. Go ahead. Go out. Go out. So I just got checked out by medical professionals. But what happens is, and and people who don't know sound don't understand this, um, they had two wireless mics on stage, okay, within about eight to ten feet of each other, turned up way too loud, and then had monitors, okay, that were also uh, really close to the mics and turned up too loud. Like, the sound was done by, like, a DJ company or something, okay, And, and, um, and so everything fed back. 
And so when they go, your 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 voice was slurred. Okay, what would happen is I would start to tell the joke into the microphone from away because I if you're too close, you'll 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 feed back. And then as it started to feed back to control that, because they I was like, Can somebody help me out here. I right, I would just veer off and just yell it to the to the thousand. And that I almost just threw the mics down and just started yelling, but I couldn't have done the show with right. my throat in the condition. I needed the amplification. And so I am I'm going through it and then there's like there's like hecklers that are heckling each other, shut up, shut up, okay? And then they're they're yelling at me, I can't hear you. I go, I can't hear anybody right now. I A, my ears are stuffed, but B, um this uh this audio is horrible. And no one scrambled okay? out to help with the audio. No, they they came out and and they they turned the monitors uh out which made it worse and so <laughs> oh, God. okay all right and and then and then the, then there's people that are leaving which they should and I understand cuz they paid for a professional show and they're just not getting it I'm giving it but they're not being able to hear it right but didn't okay. I see it then like after I mean you get off stage there's so did, many lies cops, being told they said cops showed up right well because the uh the, there was like 30 drunk people in the um, in the lobby demanding their money back and the per- Motor ran instead of talking to them, and the ticket person at the uh, that was responsible at the theater uh, did not talk to them, and then was uh, was pushing the buck to each everybody, and so people were getting pretty tired of getting lied to, which I don't I, I don't uh, uh, have a problem with at all. I get a problem with being lied to as well, and so uh, my tour manager goes out there goes. Ralphie's fine, and and because they were like he's on. Okay, the the lies that that came at me were okay that I was coked out of my mind. Okay, do I okay <laughs> look like I do cocaine? Like, no, ever? no, 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 no. never no. done it. No. Wouldn't know what to do with it. And if I had taken it, all I'd have is like eight hundred dollars worth of boogers. Okay, <laughs> that's all I would have had. I had a sinus infection. Okay, all right. And so and then they said quaaludes and. And I'm like, what? What is it, 1970? <laughs> yeah, but like, then I started to get mad. I'm like, I, I want quaaludes. If anybody's got them, I have cash. I will buy quaaludes. <laughs> yes, I will. If they're still good, okay, give me that. Man, I saw that Wolf of Wall Street like six oh, times. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I won't try that, but that's a party. Okay, I talked to old guys who used to used to rock and roll, okay, and they said those quaaludes were something else, Jack. And I'm like, man, give me a pocket of them. Okay, let's go. All right, but... They, the craziness kept on going on to where they had said that I had kicked a kid with cerebral palsy, okay, <laughs> oh, come into a wheelchair, in his wheelchair. Oh, this is all online. You can look it up, okay? All right? That I kicked into a snowbank. Okay, first of all, I'm a father of a five and a seven year old. I would never kick a child, even if that child was kicking my child. Okay, I would just stop. By the way, it. it's it, who would bring a child to your show? Exactly. I've Thank seen your you. show. That's Thank the, you. That's the first. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there's plenty of them made after, but <laughs> right. don't bring them to it. Okay, <laughs> don't bring them to it. Okay. No. All right, and so. 